Hey guys, it's John P. Jan here. We're continuing Grand Theft Auto Vice City. This is episode 17. We just stole a police car in the last episode, in case you didn't know. Now we're going to go the skull icon. Whoa, whoa. Okay, I can use open animation. Sniper, don't, don't, don't need a spaz, 12. Yeah, sure, I'll buy two of those. There we go. Now we're kind of broke, but we have some decent guns. Ooh. We need to do that. Ooh, what's this? V-Lock. Okay. What does my radio station have to do? Oh, Yes! Brilliant, bloody brilliant! Hey, Tommy! Glad you could make it. Hey, you ever met Love Fist before? No, I haven't, but I've always loved your music. Let me introduce you to the band. This is Per Percy, Dick, and Willie's in the Kazi, and that was Jez in the booth earlier. And guys, I want you to meet a good friend of mine. This is Tommy. We go way back. Hey, pal. And, uh, what was your name again? <laughs> Jez, you remember. Lovefest. Don't be playing them games with me, mate. I'm too crafty for that sunshine. English it's a Thunder P bass in that. The, the thing is, Tom, the boys need some help. They ain't too connected here. They don't have no hands, your father. We need some drugs, pal! Gotta get on the old <laughs> love yeah, fest yeah, no, fury, yeah. you know? Yeah! Well, this is Vice City, man. What's the problem? Love juice, man. We need love juice men, gang! No, that's a jazz love bass. Juice. Aye, two parts boom shine, one part trumpet, five fizz bombs, and a litre of petrol. Can you help us out, pal? Oh, it really mean a lot. You can do boys. that for the boys, right? Yeah, that's a BC Rich in the background and a Fender Jazz bass. Love Juice. Okay, I'm sure this is going to turn out well. I have a jazz. Well, I'm going to get a jazz bass soon. My bass broke. Uh, well, that's pretty far. It's going to turn. You have to have some kind of shootout. The car. Oh. Yeah. You have a nice smile. It's a good horn. Looking for something special? I got what you <laughs> need. Thanks for the money, sucker. You're supposed to get drugs, then give them. Money. This could be. This could be very helpful to. Have the siren. Let people get out of your way, man. Shit, 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 shit. <laughs> siren. The siren is the police horn. Come up, drug dealer comes up. Hey, you want to buy some? The Forrest Gump drug dealer. <laughs> ooh, ooh. Come on. Come on. Yeah! Ooh, nice shot. Yeah, I think I'll take that shot. Ooh. Hey, mate, the guys could do with some company, if you know what I mean. I know just the girl. Oh my god. We have to go get Mercedes, don't we? Yeah, we do. Control. Cortez, you mad, bro? You know, I'm just gonna leave the sirens on. My preference is police cars because, well, you can't listen to the radio, which sucks, but like, for these kind of missions, they're fast, durable, and people get the hell out of your way. Oh. Yeah, this mission is cool. Hopefully, there's no more gun play. And if there's cold play, I'm in. Rampant, 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 rampant. Wow. If you could ramp that, I would give you three million dollars. Because you'd, you'd have to be going... You'd have to be going the speed of time travel. 80 kilometers an hour. To do that, in that 
I would love to meet Sue. That was cool. I'd love. To, wow, fancy driving. I'd love to meet anyone that could ramp that in GTA Vice City. I probably shouldn't go this way. Yeah, I guess I am smirk. Hey, Mercedes. Hiya, Tommy. And how are you? Just fine. Listen, you fancy having love fist? Okay. But just as a favor, I expect returned. What? Needed on... Dude, they were in the studio. Dude, you can't finish a song. Like, I know this. You can't finish a song in a minute 20. You can't just... Just... You can't... You can't fuck a girl that quick and do your drugs. I don't know that part, but... You, know, you can just assume that you can't screw a girl and do drugs. You can do it at the same time. I don't think you can do it in under... Especially the well, <laughs> yeah. Oh, but they're not. Especially when I get there, it's gonna be like 20 seconds, and they're not gonna ram a girl and do drugs at the same time and go on 20 seconds later. Hard on. Yeah, that, 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 would, that would be that would be nightmarish to go on stage with a, with a hard on. I've never done it, but probably will happen sometime in my life. Nice scooter, brother. What? Ah. See you later, big boy. Mmm, police car, does that turn you on? Okay, you have like five seconds to ram her now. That's the love of this. I think we're just gonna go progress the story. I'll do all those missions later. I'll do all the story missions, get the story complete, because damn, we're here. We're, we're a few missions away from finishing the story. And then after that, you can uh, focus on those kind of side missions, which are much shorter. You know. so Force drug dealer. That's gonna be the name of this video. Squirt dealer. I don't. I'll remember that. 17 is supposed to be Force Gump drug dealer. Or whatever. I'll just. Whoa. If any, of you, if any of you want to see how I make my LPs, uh, just leave a comment below and I might do a video on it if requested. Um, it was simple to get some people to know how and they want to get into making LPs, so yeah, sure. I'd make a video if, if wanted. I'm sure I'll bring that up in other LPs. And I just posted a video today on, um, on uh, which LP you want me to do next, I should go check that out. Uh, I'm giving you the choice of uh, three games, or four games, which is Silent Hill Home, Homecoming, Legend of Zelda Wind Waker, Mother 3, and um, Shady O'Grady's Rising Star. It's probably going to be Shady O'Grady's Rising Star, but it might not be. If you guys vote which one you want to be, that want to be. I'll still take my own, like, like if it's like a really profound, um, definitely, you know, do it. but if it's just like one or two people are like, oh, you should do this, like, nah, I want to do that one, because she your greatest favorite cell phone. How you doing, mate? It's Paolo again. Look, Tommy, I forgot to mention, we're going to need some extra muscle for the concert. A bit of security. There's a biker gang led by Mitch Baker. It would be great publicity. Very rock and roll, baby. Sort this out for me, and I'll get you some backstage passes for the gig, all right? Cool. Mitch Baker, actually, we do few, we do a few missions for him later on. Never said the estate that was called the Cortez estate or whatever. What's the problem? Some bars refusing to pay. They reckon they're protected by a local gang of thugs. But don't worry, Tommy. I can handle it. You call this handling it? You two, off your asses. Let's go. <laughs> yep, so now we get to now we get to control people. This is where we start to be able to 
you know. Ooh, sweet car. Get in the car, useless. And to the girl in green, don't be so mean. Yeah, that's where we get to recruit people. And yeah. Uh, Saints Row. Especially number two. Put a huge inspiration from this. I mean, incorporate in this game. This was the first Grand Theft Auto that did this. Then, of course, it was expanded upon with um, Grand Theft Auto San Andreas, where you can recruit your uh, Saint Park. Uh, your. Whatever. It's Salabex. Whatever. Yeah, I can spit street. again. I forget what Salibex the game is called. But, um, Salibex yeah, you get to the group from off the street, but this one you have to go to your state. Or if you like buy property along the city, that's what it's for, too. Uh, yeah, so After a night out, my tongue group people will help you kill people. It was embarrassing. Now, so they die I kind of easily, but or lick my life partner's stamp collection. Oh, nice. So kill them, I it's suppose. like having a salivation uh, army in my mouth. Huh, that was easy. Hey, Pavila, Benigna, wake up to reality. The protection needs a little more protection. Ah, oh, hell, not again. I don't need this crap. These idiots operate out of DBP security around the block. The guys just sorted out amongst themselves. I'll be seeing you later. Yeah, yeah, whatever. But one. Go get move, bitch. <laughs> wow, see he's dead. Get not moving. No, I do not. No violence against women. I'm quite against it. But this is really good. Giggle cream! Oh, it makes oh, dessert. Any consequences. I'm actually against violence for anybody. I don't discriminate on this channel. Alright. See, men get violated too, but not I guess not nearly as much as women. Which is, you know, it's it's sad really. The shit that goes on in this world. Whoa. My dad oh, is a pigeon, and my there. mom is a fly. Is that right? Well, sort of, genicalistically speaking, but you bang on, and you know speaking. what that also yeah. means? I left my guy back there. He's probably just running. Oh my god, that reminds me of um. This one time that my friends and I were at uh, the lake, we call it. Which is what it is at the lake. But um, there's this one kid. Well, that's my point. Yeah. I'll, I'll tell the story about this. Uh, there's this one, there's this group of kids um, that we know, you know, they're pretty cool kids, um, that we know, and they're uh, coming down uh, this hill, the most that, which is near the lake. So my friends and I are just sitting there, you know, chilling in the sun, soaking in the day, seizing the day. But, um, carp game. Anyway, um, I don't know what the plural flag is. Our running out of time. Anyway, so we're just the sitting there, and, and we see these group of kids come down on their bikes and scooters. Like, okay, and that's cool. Do it. But then, uh, we, they Let's passed a little while before with this other kid who, um, was riding, and who, who was, didn't have a bike and, and was hitching a ride with someone else other days, on their like bike. Or so it's like, okay, birthday, well, we don't see Mitchell. I want to hide under the pillows and just drop back down. But that's me. He lived around there. But, um, about 30 seconds later, after uh, we see, after the kids come down the hill, Mitchell comes sprinting down the hill, but just like by him, he, he's just running, and it was oh, it was just perfect timing. Like you, you just you just kind of had to be there, and you you kind of had to be in the circle of friends or know them. But yeah, it was just, it was no just man, so I'm mind-numbingly depressed. Anyway, I'm John P. Jam, and I'll see okay. you guys. Okay, I'm going to have to interrupt you there.